Hi students, this is Mr. Panico, and I am uh, presenting here a little demo, demonstration of the Google Slide presentation feature in your school email account, which is really a Google email account. When you uh, log into your email, go up to the top and click on Documents, and then from the document page, which is what you see right now, my document page, from your document page, once you go to Create New, button and click on presentation which I'm doing right now and um, now you have the um, presentation document up and um, so you can see what what's uh, what's going on I'll just move this around over here you have your save button okay and you have a, a really it's like a PowerPoint slide here okay and you're gonna make eight PowerPoint slides or Google slides for this document. The first four slides will be on the four different types of caves and then the remaining four slides will be on uh, whatever cave features you want to uh, present. Alright, and over here you see you have a um, word processor bar. I'm going to click on this. I'm going to type in here caves uh, formation all right so now notice notice the mouse right now when I bring it over to this little text box it turns into a four-point mouse which means I can now grab this and drag it up to the top so now I have the um, the header for my presentation and I'm gonna go over here and note watch the mouse I'm gonna go over to this little bounding box I'm gonna grab it and I can make this a little smaller okay but now all the um, uh, features of the word processor are available up here at the top. Now I want to start typing something, so I'm going to click over here on the uh, one moment. Click over here on the text box, click, and now I have a box up here that I can start writing text. So I'm going to move this box up a little bit, and I'm going to say here solution caves. Now what do I want to say about solution caves? Let's see, solution caves are created by the acid in the brown water dissolving the limestone or other types of Soluble rock. Okay, there's my first paragraph. I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to move it over to the side. I'm going to bring it in a little bit. See how I'm just grabbing, grabbing it with the mouse? Okay, now I'm going to uh, bring in a picture. And to do that, you go to this, this picture icon, click on it, and um, I'm going to click in that little box first, and then I'm going to grab the picture off my computer. So I recommend that you click on the pictures that you want from the web, right click and say save picture as, download it to your computer, and then and then upload it to Google Docs from your computer. I'm going to click on the browse button. Okay. Click on it again. There you go. I had to click on it twice. And I'm going to grab um, the following picture of a solution cave. This one is really cool. You've seen it before. I'm going to click on OK. And now the picture has appeared. I'm going to bring this down a bit. Now, see these boxes on the corners of the picture? It allows me to drag the picture to smaller size, rescale it, and I'm going to hit the Shift key so that when it rescales, it rescales um, proportional. I'm going to grab this picture, put it over here, get rid of this box. Huh. Well, okay, so that could be my first slide, for example. All right. Now to create another slide, I'm going to grab 
this window move over here so you can see over here in the left side panel where the uh, slides appear in thumbnail form. I'm going to click on that little air, uh, plus sign and I'm going to choose this type of slide and now the slide is here and here. It's here in the thumbnail and then the actual slide is over on the right. I'm going to come back here. So this one might be C caves. Okay. Click here to write about C caves. Whatever. All right. And then I go back and grab another picture. Move this up for you. Click here, grab another picture, put it in there, adjust it, format it the way I want, create a new slide for um, two more of the types of caves, and then four more slides for the different types of features in caves, like the uh, spiliothems, the stalactites, stalagmites, and all the other many features that you saw in the virtual cave uh, lab. And also, uh, you can search any website on the internet, and... Um, uh, find pictures anywhere, like for example in the Google Images search, and uh, um, provide a picture and a little description of each cave feature and each of the four main types of caves. And then when you're done with this presentation, this next part's very important. Look where I'm bringing the uh, window. I'm going over here to the share box. You have to share this with me, and there's only one way I want you to share it with me and that is to take the web address that's provided from this share box. I'm going to click on this, and I'm going to click on Get the Link to Share, and it opens up a dialog box. I'll bring this window over so you can see it. And all you need to do in this box is click on the little uh, uh, box inside that says Allow Anyone with the Link to View. And here's the link. The link appeared when I clicked on this little checkbox. All you have to do is highlight it, control C to copy it, or maybe right click and copy it. Okay? And then you then you go to the the um, quiz itself, the uh, and and open it up, go down to the um, text box and paste that in there and submit it to me. That's the only web address I want. Let me show you what I don't want. I'm gonna take this view and I'm going to bring it up here to the browser web address. Do not show me that. Do not send that one to me because I can't open it. All right? But I can open up this web address that came from the share button. That's what you want to submit to me. I'll click on it from in Moodle and then I'll come to and look at your presentation. It's worth 24 points, 3 points per slide. And it's your way of being creative and your way of expressing what you learned for this lesson on caves.